Stop recording. It was dim and old and worked for tea. The Gestapo was a raging that day. Looking for murder and ashen. And drunks who were lying in the lanes. No two of the constable's agents. They were frowning and the roaring with the steam. They were looking for farming three women and a dog. Wanted for peeing the closes and lanes. Now it was twelve o'clock when they found out. But of them in old alleyway. It was a tired bastard boot body with tire marks all up its face wood. Well, they went through the usual procedure, kicked it to make sure it was dead. They shared out its cash, stole its credit card, and smoked all its fags. Well, it bled. It was four o'clock, and then he found her propped up in an old chip shop door. It was naked beneath by a no ring its neck, not wanted on beats three or four. Is sometimes uh, you end up playing two different tunes. Box wants to play one, and you have to play the other. <laughs> uh, but that was a that was a tune to one of my um, Scottish friends. She left the safety and tranquility of England for the uh, vast unknown. She travelled many miles across barren wastelands and unknown deserts and, and all sorts of crazy things until settled in Scotland. Well, the the fringes of Scotland, Edinburgh, anyway, so it's sort of cosmopolitan Scotland. So I thought we'd have a Scottish song, and that one is for, as I say, that's for a friend of mine who now lives in Scotland, and because we came up with a nickname, a new nickname for one of her friends, um, <laughs> which just I, I found really funny, so. Um, and that song also goes out for the gallant police force of Glasgow City. What, you want to do another? Okay. Squeezebox wants to do another one. Oh, okay. I'm not sure how this is going to go. We didn't rehearse this one. It's like a sooty show, this. <laughs> Last train to Glasgow Central. Last train to Glasgow Central. And on the train... In him. I was hiding in the lobby when the ticket man came Biddy biddy bum bum Tick Glasgow Central <laughs> I'm out of here